Welcome back, everyone. Ah, uh, Thomas. I have to drive all the way. Agent up. Morgan. Wait, I'm still driving. Past 2100. Let's meet up again at the community center. Can tomorrow. I do other stuff? I haven't now? been sleeping much since this all started, to be honest. I'm exhausted. I was just about to suggest the same thing. I'll make arrangements for people to gather between 1500 and 1700. Holy shit. All right. I'll try and nice. get as many people as I can to come, so don't be late. Okay? Don't be late. I'll be there. What if I do an... Uh, the community center's late. on the south side. I've marked it on your map. Thanks, Thomas. Well then, s see you tomorrow. Okay, uh... What the fuck is that? Uh... Yeah, I should eat something. Yeah, okay, we're... Let's eat. Let's, uh, yeah, get in car. This game needs waypoints badly. Nope, my bad. Let's eat. Uh, I'll probably eat at the hotel, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Wait, hold on. Where am I? Where the fuck? Okay, yeah. Let's. We can take this road all the way. I think. Yeah, let's go back. Alright, here we go. This is the road, right? Yeah. Um... I think it's a little too late now, right? And gas is... Oh, shit! Yeah, I think gas is gonna screw me over in this game. What is that? Speaking of 80s movies, one jewel in the rough springs to mind. Deadly Spawn. Do you remember that one, Zach? Back in 83, directed by Douglas McCown. Right, it was filmed pretty cheap, but still it was pretty good. The monster design with the mouth crammed full of teeth, I loved it. So many delicious B-movie cliches. Did you know that they made a sequel? But I never got to see the sequel. The rental store didn't have it for some reason. They said the staff for the sequel was totally different from the original. I wonder how the sequel turned out. You know, the monster in that one responded to sound. Wait, Zach. Sounds a lot like the movie I Trump. was gonna say, actually. I think that one was back in 89, directed by Ron Underwood. I, I now, think that was a great like role a, for Kevin Bacon. There was like a Tremors Masterpiece. 3, isn't there? Zach, that one had sequels like crazy. I remember there was okay, a fourth one. Okay, there's a fourth one, alright. I've right. only seen the first one, though. Okay, that's... Alright, okay, uh, York knows his shit. What is this? Ah, fuck. Ah, damn. Fuck it. Wait. Wait, hold on. Let's go back. Uh, let's get out of the car real quick. Hey. Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? We need yeah. to be at the community center by 1500 today. Yeah, there is. Just think of talking in front of all those people. What do you think, Zach? It's going to get fun. What is this? Uh... No, I'm trying to... God damn it. No, I'm trying to pick flowers. Fuck you. There we go. Flowers. This flower. There's something very mesmerizing about it. I wonder what it's called. I'll take one with me and ask someone later. Flower with no name. Alright. I tried getting this, but like... Come on, get in car. Get in car. And yeah, apparently it's like one of those cutscene things. I should eat though. I'm kind of hungry myself, damn it. Alright, so we're here, right? Um, come on. 
Good. Okay, there. Straight. I think I should just take the. Yeah, alright, yeah. Straight and then my f the first right. Ever. All oh, right. Since um, I was unable to. Tremors. I think Fred Ward. I was unable to record. You this. say Fred Ward, and I say, Remo Williams. The adventure begins. That one was back in '85, I think. Directed by Guy Hamilton. Guess Hamilton was aiming to start a series like 007, but it had no sequels. A real shame. Do you remember the martial arts they used in that film, called Sinanju? The ultimate in martial arts, using no weapons at all. Remo's master Chun ran across water, remember? And he loved soap operas. Man, that was a good character. He was played by Joel Grey, the best supporting actor in Cabaret. Of course, in Remo, he had so much makeup on you couldn't tell. All right, uh, hold on. What the fuck was I saying? Shit. Yeah, but so basically, this is kind of the route I took going from from the uh, the forest, from the crime scene to the uh, sawmill. So I guess it's kind of like this, but in reverse, of course. Do I have enough gas for this? That's kind of the question here. Hold on. Uh, well, I have enough time tomorrow, so... Alright. What the fuck? Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. There's fishing. There's a fishing spot here. Uh, I honestly, I need to know where the weapon is. Fuck it. Where the weapon, where the weapon shop is. We'll be fine. Oh god, I hope like... I don't, I hope like we don't get like a big substantial portion of this game dedicated to driving from point A to point B. Because you're just going to be stuck with me talking. Possibly with York, if ever the prompt comes up. I, I have a feeling like I'm going to miss it though. Ah, shit. Ah, fuck. 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 No. No. <laughs> no. Damn it. Okay, yeah. Alright, I'm sorry. I did not expect that. Well, no, 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 no. I should have expected that. And oh my god, I'm I'm losing frame rates. Holy shit. Pretty now Joel Gray's daughter is of course. That's right, Jennifer Gray. You knew that, right, Zach? No. Jennifer Gray. She's in one of my most favorite movies. Ferris Bueller's Day Off. 1986, directed by John Hughes. Huh, that one was so 80s. Zach, you're not the most cheerful guy I know. But you really do like those cheerful movies. I'm a little miserable. We used to but... love those teenage movies back then, didn't we? Breakfast Club and Pretty in Pink, St. Elmo's Fire, and Fast Times at Ridgemont High. That last one was in 1982, directed by Amy Heckerling. Now that was an impressive film. You've got Sean Penn in the lead, with Jennifer Jason Lee and Phoebe Cates, not to mention Nicolas Cage and Forrest Whitaker were in it too. And the original book and the script were written by Cameron Crowe. How could that not be a great film? Do you remember, Zach? When that movie ended, the last words, the end, was from an arcade game. That's right, it was from Missile Command. That stuck in my head for a while. The memories. I feel like I have a lot of movies to catch up on. Holy Let's shit, just hope so we can get I. to the end of this case soon. Then maybe we can catch up on a few. Give... Oh. Yeah, alright. Zach, we're here. Let's continue our chat later. Maybe, you yeah. know. Zach, oh, Emily flash. arranged for people to come between 1500 and 1700. We can't do anything here right now. Let's come back at the right time. You fucking hell, shit! Damn it! Where the fuck am I? Okay, uh... I thought this was the, the hotel. Fuck. Okay, uh... Can I take another car? Can I commandeer another car? No? Fuck. Okay. It's fine. Damn it. Where am I? Where's the hotel?
No, I fuck. Okay, uh shit. Shit, 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 shit. Okay. Where the fuck okay, hold on. Uh move map mission. Fight this main target. Becky's house. Gallery. Sheriff's Department. Galaxy of Terror. No. Um Uh is this yeah, this is it. This is the deer hotel thing in Bob. Where the fuck am I going? Okay, alright, I'm here. Right? Uh shit, shit, shit. Fuck you. Okay. Uh Okay, it's not too bad. Although I'm going to need a bank. What the fuck is this? Come on. What is this then? Ah uh, damn it. Come on. Hey. Galaxy of Terror. Oh fuck it. Uh you know, let's just head on south. I'm sorry, I almost ran into that one. Shit. Fuck! Okay. What if you go off-roading here? I'll try that. Okay, but yeah, I did promise, like, I'll try to flip the car over. I just didn't do it on purpose this time. Holy shit! Ah, fuck! Zack, picking up from where we left off... Really now? Now, okay. Joel Gray's daughter is, of course... That's right, Jennifer Gray. You knew that, right, Zack? Jennifer Gray. She's in one of my most favorite movies. Ferris Bueller's Day Off. 1986, directed by John Hughes. Huh, that one was so 80s. Zack, you're not the most cheerful guy I know. But you really do like those cheerful movies. We used to love those teenage movies back then, didn't we? Breakfast Club and Pretty in Pink, St. Elmo's Fire, and Fast Times at Ridgemont High. That last one was in 1982, directed by Amy Heckerly. Now that was an impressive film. You've got Sean Penn in the lead, with Jennifer Jason Lee and Phoebe Cates, not to mention Nicolas Cage and Forrest Whitaker were in it too. And the original book and- Hold on, if I- Okay, I can actually skip it, all right. Uh need the map south and that it that's it yeah okay good that's good good we're good oh thank fucking god it's just so how fucking limited how oh, hold on this came around GTA 4 I think so the concept of like waypoints is still there. There we go. Well, there shouldn't be any ex any excuse to not have it, but like I guess Sweary wanted a bit of like. God, who the fuck? Who 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 does who directed Shenmue? I guess he wanted that sort of vibe where. Every mis <laughs> every minuscule thing is like accounted for. Yeah, I know I'm at eight percent. Holy shit! How do I? Now my only issue now is uh... is this it? I I, I don't know anymore. Zack, is there something here that you want to check out? Just we need like, to be at the community center by 1500 today. Just think of talking in front of all those people. What this, do you think, Zack? The, the it's end? going to get... It's hard to tell. This is it, right? Hi, Paul. Alright. Polly, I am... Oh, hi. I'm gonna sleep. You're seeing... What do you have then? That's not much. All right, well, let's get out of here. Now, my only problem now is, uh, 
number. Oh wait, this is my room. This is this is it. Yeah. We'll have breakfast. We're gonna have a big day and. Um, yeah, moderate sounds good. Hmm. And I am hungry. I gotcha. All right, yeah. We're gonna eat. Have bread. What time is it? Hold on. What time is it? Let's see. Um, it's. Oh, it's three in the morning. Holy shit. Can I eat though? Let's see. Let's see if I can eat. I'm not sure if I should eat from here though. So. Alright. Can I eat? I. Wait, what is this? Coffee. Coffee. Let's have our coffee. I doubt this helps with uh, hunger. Unexpected troubles come your way. Lucky item, lighter. There's always trouble heading my way in this job. But I'm always up for a little excitement, too. Same again? Wait, what do you mean by same again? I'll, I'll, I'll get... Oh, okay, hold on. Oh, okay, let's just skip this. No, no, we're good. We're good. There's no need. There's no need. I... I do need to eat. Where the fuck? Okay, there's... There's just no breakfast here. Fuck. Okay. Let's just get out of here. Wait, I do have stuff in my inventory, so... Ooh, very nice. Alright, uh... Yeah, don't it. This, this should be good, right? Uh... Okay, alright, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Uh, and my health went down. Did I just, like, give myself a mini heart attack or something? <laughs> no! Okay, let's just put... Yeah, let's top up on health. This is stupid. Well, I was being stupid. Alright, let's get... Alright, let's get out of here. Let's get out. Well, that was... <laughs> okay, she's asleep. Ah, oh, fuck, everyone's asleep. God damn it. Okay, I'll sleep too. All right, hold on. Let's uh, let me look back at how many, how much, how much, uh, what are our options for sleep? Come on, it's fine. You don't need to peek. All right. Um. Yeah, light sleep. It's three. Uh, yeah, I'll, I think. Yeah. <sighs> Damn it, okay, so, um, eight. Alright. So, hold on, if I eat too much, does it, like, drain on health or something? Like it, alright, it's ten. Hello, ma'am. I am going to... We're gonna buy weapons. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna buy weapons. I need... I have so much cash on me right now. Okay, it's still raining. Great, okay. Uh, I hope someone gassed this up. Hopefully. Damn it, no. No, forget it. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Using another car. How about this one? Let's use this one.
Yo, thank you so much for watching. Follow me on these links so that I could remind you that this is a warning, not a guarantee.